This is why I love when you guys post comments and questions. Someone commented on one of my videos, the video titled how to set up a professional looking business email. So this person watched the video and they posed a really great question that I didn't even think of um, while filming the video. Okay, so the question goes, when responding to the email, does the reply show up as the alias name or the Gmail email address? That is a great question. And thanks to you for asking stuff like that because that, you know, sometimes when I'm making these videos, I don't really um, think about all the things that might brew up in your mind, you know, for me to address. So when you go into the comments and you ask these type of questions, that helps me um, better prepare or give me ideas on what the next video should be, you know, um, because I'm making these videos for you and, you know, the things that I go through, it can help you. So anything that I've been through, I am glad to help and share with you along your journey. Oh, sunshine, you are my sunshine. Let it be in, let it be in. Oh, hey beauties, thank you for tuning in to another one of my YouTube videos. If this is your first time being here, welcome and thank you for tuning in. Let me introduce myself. My name is Larice, and I am the founding owner of beyondbody.com. Before we hop into the video, make sure you subscribe to this channel, hit that like button, and be sure to hit the bell notification so every time I upload a new video, you will be notified. So let's get into this video. Okay, so here we are. I am sharing my screen, and so I'm just going to, well, right now, I am in my beyondbody at gmail.com email account. So I have opened a brand new composed email that I'm going to send to myself, my personal um, email address. And it's just something real random um, just to see what it says when um, Beyond Body sends an email out to somebody. Okay, so hello, testing. All right, so then I'm going to send it. Okay, so here we are in my personal email. And as you can see, it landed in the inbox and it says skincare at beyondbody.com. Even though you guys watched me, um, I was in my beyondbody at gmail.com account and that's where I sent um, the little test email to my personal email address. So as you can see right here, it says skincare at beyondbody.com. Let's open it up to make sure this is the one that I just sent. And so it says, hello there friend, this is just a test. And then it says skincare at beyondbody.com. And then right here in the little alias, it does show beyondbody at gmail.com. So I don't know if this part would really bother you or not, um, but when they, or maybe it just shows up like that on my end because um, it might be all connected. I'm not really sure. So when after I show you how to set it up like this, when you do a test, maybe you can check it out and see if in this little um, section right here, if it'll say your at gmail.com part. But um, once it lands into a customer or potential customer, whoever you're sending your email to, once it ends in their inbox, then it will say, you know, the alias or the professional looking until they open it then it may or may not have this piece right here. But at least to me, that's not really a big deal because while it's sitting in their inbox, it shows up professionally, if that makes sense. So um, let me get into how you set it up to where when you reply from your Gmail account, it will still show up looking professional instead of it saying blah, blah, blah at gmail.com in someone's inbox. 
Okay, so here we are. We are back on my beyondbody at gmail.com account. And what you want to do is go over to the top right, right here um, where I'm hovering around the settings gear. You want to click on settings and then right here where it says see all settings. You want to click on see all settings. So once you click on there, there's two things that I want to show you. Um, first, you want to, we're in the general right here. We're on general. And so you want to scroll all the way down and um, you want to add where it says my picture. You want to have your business logo right there. You know, I think that helps as well um, just to have your business logo so you stand out and it doesn't just look like blah. So that's the first thing. And then um, you want to go over to accounts and import. And so accounts and import is one, two, three after general. If you can see right here, accounts and import. So you want to scroll down to where it says, uh, let me highlight just that. Send mail as. This is the section you want to be at. And so under send mail as, that is where you can change it to, um, for example, mine, skincare at beyondbody.com. This is where you put in your alias. Um, so it doesn't just say, for example, from beyondbody at gmail.com. You want it to say whatever. Um, alias you created for your domain name. But this is where you go. And so um, once you enter it in, then um, you just push save and then send out a test email to one of your personal email accounts or if you want to send it to a friend or family member to test it out and see how it looks, then do that. Um, let me unshare this. So uh, if you have any more questions, please make sure you leave them down in the comment section. And if I have the answers, I'll answer it. Um, if I don't have the answers, I will be 100% transparent and I'll let you know that I do not know the answer. Um, but hopefully this video was informative. Again, um, if you have any other questions, please leave them down in the comments. Let me know um, if this helped, if this worked out for you. I'm pretty sure it'll work uh, because this is being recorded in 2021. So this is exactly how the settings look in the back of Gmail. If you are using Yahoo, Hotmail, or any other um, third-party provider for your email, this video probably won't work for you and I probably won't have the answers to address whatever issues that you might run into. I am using Gmail, therefore I am able to explain how Gmail works. So again, thank you for tuning in. It is your girl Reese here. If you know any other entrepreneur that might be needing help with this same situation, be sure to uh, share this video out. I greatly appreciate that. Take care. Love you all beauties. Bye.